Hello everyone. <coughs> Today we are going to learn how to connect Excel with MySQL database using VBA. To connect MS Excel with MySQL database using VBA, we need MySQL OLEDB drivers which are easily available on MySQL official page. Link is given in the description to download MySQL OLEDB drivers. You need to diver, download the drivers as per the installed office application bits. If it is 64 bits, then download the 64 bit drivers. If it is 32 bits, then use the 32 bits drivers. Let's visit to MySQL official page to download OLEDB drivers. Here, you will able to see you have a 32 bit drivers as well and 62 bit drivers as well. As I mentioned you check your office application beats and then download the drivers. Once it has been downloaded, it's an easy to install these drivers. Reboot your system and now let's go to Excel. This is our Excel application. Okay. We will go to the VB editor window. Now let's in insert one module. Let's start writing subroutine. First, we will declare two variables. One is for the connection, one is for the record set. We are going to use let binding concept. Hence, I have declared both variables as a object. Now, set these variables to the specific object. Set obgcnn is equal to create object in the bracket adobb dot connection and set object rs is equal to create object adodb dot record set now let's write down the connection string Now let's open the connection and simultaneously I'll write it down, close, we press it here, stop, let's debug the code. Our connection is successfully open, let me close the connection, done, okay, let's put one message box. Now. Let's get the records of a table into the object record set. Okay.
let us print this object record set into excel range. This is done. Now let us test the connection. connection is working fine. Let us see if we are able to get the data into our object record set. Yes. Now let us see how we can print it into and close the connection message box done and if you will notice you are able to see the data printed from A to range. I have used limit 10 query here because the data is large in the size. This is an easy way to connect your Excel to MySQL and get the data. Similarly, you can insert the data, you can fire all the queries like insert, delete, update if you have the rights. Thanks everyone, please share and subscribe the video.